You see, this is what we need to have. Just no talking. We've had enough of the talking. Let's just go in pure, just raw knuckle, beating the shit out of each other's face and all that. Like, we don't even need chakra. Let's just fucking go. I was like, God damn, this fucking chapter of Naruto. Like, we're just going in with these two, just fighting. Like, even at the start and all that, when he, like, unleashed his injured arrow, which, you know, using all of the tail of his chakra, this thing, like, pretty much exhausted the fuck out of him, even using, like, Hidori, like, he couldn't barely just even co conjure one up in his, like, chapter, because they're, they're that exhausted, like, even, like, Naruto used this as an advantage by using shadow clothes, and he was just beating the shit out of Sasuke with it. It was only thanks to, like, some little ninja shurikens that he had in his, like, little wrist and all that, that he was able to, to repel him back. I'm not gonna lie, though, I feel like this is definitely right about the end right now. It feels like this chapter was pretty much their fight, and that next chapter is going to pretty much conclude it, and then we're going to have, you know, the little final chapters, and then just have everything to conclude it, and then we have the movie. I was just like, God damn, like, the fucking just raw fighting in this chapter. Like, both of them exhausted their chakras at one point. Like, even, like, Naruto had a little bit left like that to pull the revenge on, but he tripped in the life. Let's fucking go. Taijutsu. Tied fucking jutsu like that. And like beating the living shit out of one another. And I'm not gonna lie, it that was just like some police brutality shit that Sasuke was doing because he was just beating the living fuck, punching him in the face, kicking him in the ribs like that. And I was like, ah, damn, like that. It was like, it definitely shows that he just wants to win. And it was even shown that at the end that he will do the dirtiest tricks and all that in this stuff. I'm not going to see, like, why the point, like, Sakura is waking up and all that and saying, like, I honestly don't think she's going to do anything important. It's just, like, she's going to be there for, like, the last chapter and, like, see, like, what happened to him. I hope it's kind of like, um, if anyone saw that little OVA where Naruto and Sasuke had their fight last time, I want her to see, like, oh, she th thinks, like, Naruto's dead or something. She's, like, crying over him. And then, you know, we see Sasuke disappear. He's, like, mortally wounded. And he just wakes up with a smile on his face. I really wanted to do that because if anyone's ever seen that OVA, it's absolutely amazing and I'd highly recommend it. And it was like a preview of what the Naruto Sasuke fight would have looked at their powers at that current point in the war. It was just honestly an amazing thing to see. So I'm hoping for something like that that the two like return to. And pretty much they're both on the floor, barely able to move. They're just barely like punching each other. And I'm like... These two have exhausted each other, and, like, Naruto's like, I've got, a, like, the Nine Tails now about to give them some chakra, and it's like, hang on, you can do some more, if I give you this, and it's like, God fucking damn, even him, like, he just steals some fucking chakra out of him, because that is how fucking cheap he is, it's like, you cheap motherfucker, you're using the Nine Tails chakra, which I'm guessing, like, since he's got the Rinnegan now, that he's pretty much able to, you know, just control everything like that. Like, because I honestly don't remember when he could control, like, rip out people's chakra and stuff like that. I think maybe one of the pains could have done that. I'm not particularly... I, I know one of them could have blocked jutsus. I know I knew that much. So maybe, technically, it can absorb it as well and get it into, like, pains, like, continuous, like, chakra. I don't fucking know. But it's just, like, both of them are barely able to move and just right at the last minute, it's like, fucking nine times fucks up. Gives Sasuke some chakra because he ripped it out of him. And he's now about to go into Chidori. And it's like, damn, fucking end right there. Right stab there. And it's like, either Naruto is going to make one last little pinch right now. Like where he's just going to be able to come back. Like come back really quick and just Rasengan or just dodge it. Or someone's going to interrupt it. I hope no one interrupts the fight. That's one thing. Like this should just be their little thing right now. Just no one interfere. And that's what I personally think of that. But. Overall, this was an awesome chapter, like, hardly any dialogue, that's one thing I could say, but that's fine, some chapters don't need to have that dialogue, because you've got this shit, and it's awesome, so definitely, yeah, I really enjoyed this one, I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10, and, yeah, let me know what you think in the comment section down below, but that's all for me, I want to say thank you so much for watching, as always, and I'll see you guys.